it's chaos, I tell you, here on Tragic MTG. So, I was at the local Walmart with my son, who is out sick today with cardboard fever. Got him some Pokemon cards. And I thought, well, let's take a look at the magic stuff, too. And there's a lot of, like, you know, the standard sets. And I noticed that they have these back again. Usually I don't go for these kind of things at Walmart, especially not the ones that come in, like, you know, plastic boxes that are, you know, definitely trash. You've seen the professor open those. You've seen other people open those. But this one has got a little potential, right? So for $19.99, six assorted boosters from recent Magic sets. And uh, that's actually a pretty good price for six just generic packs of random chaos. Who knows, right? Um, I believe that uh, the distributor of these is kind of cleaning out their old stock because these haven't been on out for a while. I think they have a new package that's actually newer. So this may actually be some older stuff uh, that you may not find in the newer ones. So let's find out. What did I get? I think you get one promo and maybe some good stuff like Kaladesh. That's kind of what I was hoping for. Let's see here. Okay, here's the promo. We got a Beast Whisperer. That's actually not bad. An in foil. And it's the promo version. So I'll look that one up here at the end. I always scan these up and see how I did on my purchase. But that's uh, off to a good start there. We've got a Rivals of Ixalan. we got a Guilds of Ravnica. An Unstable, one of my favorite things to bust open. we got an actual original Return to Ravnica. Another Guilds of Ravnica. And a Kaladesh. So let's see. With Guilds of Ravnica in there being kind of the newest here, we can kind of pinpoint that this box was packaged sometime in the last year or so whenever that came out um, so it's maybe not as old as I thought it was but hey it's still giving out Kaladesh packs so let's uh, let's see how we do let's see let's let's put this to the back second to last let's open this on stable first we'll at least get a uh, full art land out of this could it possibly be a foil oh, okay I opened it backwards anyway. Let's see what we get here. Let's get it real close. We got a, whoops, magic word. A joyride rigor. These are just so fun. I love unstable. I need to start working on my unstable unset cube that I'd like to build. It'll be uh, a lot of the newer ones. Mad science fair project. Secret base. Gimme five is an uncommon. Uh, let's separate them out here. Steam Floggery. I do have a foil. The Half Kitten, Half Something Else. And a Sum in the Pack, a Mythic from Unstable, which are not worth a whole lot, but they sure are fun. For seven and a black sorcery, open a sealed magic booster pack, reveal the cards, and put all creature cards revealed this way onto the battlefield under your control. They're zombies in addition to their other types. And uh, even got like a zombie Fibble Thip right there. That's awesome. And a shark and a unicorn is great. What else? We got a full art forest. These are beautiful. I'm happy to have that. And a genetic recombinator. And an inflation station. And a foil token. Brainiac. Okay. At least got some fun out of that pack. Um, the full art forest is maybe a buck or two. Um, so that's a win in my book there. Off to a good start. Let's put my foil beast whisperer. Right there. All right, Guilds of Ravnica. Open it up. This is total chaos. Total chaos. Like a Cosmotronic wave. Go through these a little bit quicker. Oops, I missed one. And see if I can at least make my 20 bucks back. All it takes is one like really super good mythic here. Necrotic Wound, Justice Strike, Thought Erasure. You thought you were done with it. Nope, it's there. And a Narc Amoeba. It's a two-drop creature illusion. And if it uh, put into your graveyard from your library, you may put it onto the battlefield. There it goes. The classic. A Guild Gate and an Insect. Cool. I'm not going to put that there. All right, let's do another Guilds of Ravnica pack. It's already, already halfway open. I noticed that about Guilds of Ravnica packs. They always uh, kind of split like that. There we go. The Henri Goblin. And to the Uncommons, a Rock Charger. 
Crackling Drake, I do get a foil. Gird for battle. It is a guild gate. I got a steam vents though. That's awesome. And a Demir guild gate and foil. So that's a winner. And I got a guild gate and a foil guild gate. Great. Um, sure, sure. Right here. I now have three Demir guild gates. I might just build a gates deck out of that. Rivals of Ixalan. I haven't opened much of Rivals. I opened a lot of Ixalan. I kind of skipped this set. Let's get into it and see what we get. All kind of dinosaurs. And some merfolks. And some vampires. And some pirates. I do like the Ixalan setting. I'm sure we'll be back there eventually. Got a Sky Marcher Aspirant. A possibly flying vampire. Curious Obsession. Reaver Ambush. And a Wayward Sword Tooth. Two, two and a green Ascend. It's a 5-5 five, five Dinosaur. You may play an additional land on each of your turns. Wayward Sword Tooth can't attack or block unless you have the City's Blessing. That's uh, probably pretty good just for the additional land drop. Um, you can probably build around that. And you got a Foil Woodland Stream. And an Island and a Sapperling. Alright, not too bad. Alright, Return to Ravnica. Uh, which now is totally back in style because of Pioneer. Same with Kelidus. It's kind of why I wanted to buy this and see if I got lucky with some uh, older sets that are now coming back around again. Um, this company puts in old sets because, uh, you know, nobody wants those anymore. But now, all of a sudden, everybody does. So, you know me, I'm a gambler. I like to see what it gets. Got an Aqua Steed, Slitherhead. New Prov Guild Mage and a Conjured Currency, which is the worst. Five and a blue. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may exchange control of Conjured Currency and target permanent you neither own nor control. Yeah, I'm uh, not, not a big fan of that card. We got a tip card and a foil traitorous instinct. So there's that. All right, last up, Kaladesh potential uh, uh, masterpiece in here that would be great I imagine that whoever uh, packages these up they probably weigh every pack of Kaladesh and make sure that you don't get an extra foil uh, dramatic reversal some rats larger than life renegade tactics some assemblers now, there is a foil in there. Console Shield Guard. Oops, wrong pile. Disappearing Act. Ooh, Sky Sovereign. Console Flagship, a Mythic. It costs five. It's a legendary artifact vehicle. Flying whenever this enters the battlefield or attacks, it deals three damage to target creature or planeswalker and opponent controls. And it costs three to crew. It's a 6 5. Pretty cool. Nothing super big. And we got a foil tidy conclusion which is exactly what this is and i got a nissa emblem cool all right let's scan them up and see if i made my 20 bucks back all right ready to scan i don't think any of these foils are going to be much but i will grab that forest and the rares and mythics i don't think there were any good uncommon so we're just going to move that stuff out of the way here we go Probably going to hinge on that steam vent, so let's see how we did. A uh, Unstable Forest, 391 on the TCG mid. We got a Sky Sovereign, not quite enough there. The Conjured Currency should be even less. Yep, 33 cents. A Wayward Sword Tooth. Wow, that's actually really good. I think I called it with that additional land ability. That's pretty solid, so. 640 and a steam vents is it 10 bucks it's more than 10 bucks 13.99 so i definitely did pretty good on this narc amoeba 49 cents a beast whisperer in the foil promo version and uh, it doesn't like there we go 224 but let's take a look at the promo version there we go 310 for the promo pack. I think that's the foil version. Yep, that must be it. Not too bad. And then a summon the pack as a mythic. Only 92 cents, but there it is. So, hey, I made like 10 bucks on my gamble. So, that's how it is. 
Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Comment down below. And I'll catch you in the next one.